Hello, Lucas. Hi. Hello, good evening. Good evening for you. How, How are, are today? you doing? Oh, I'm good. How about you? I'm glad to hear that. I saw your uh, bio says have fun. Yeah, I'm just, you know, posting meme page something. Mm. Are you having fun on TikTok or in real life? <laughs> <laughs> well, um, yeah, a lot, I guess. <laughs> That's good, at least. Very important. And the weekend is just starting, so perfect time. Really? Yeah, it is. I have so much time in here to t on TikTok anyway. I spend almost five hours a day, and it's really crazy, you know? That is a lot. What are you watching within those five hours? Um, that's random stuff, but uh, did you know about Broke and Jubal in the morning radio station? I'm not sure, no. What is it? Yeah, some, uh, yeah. Um, it's such a prank and from radio station and any other segment like second up, second death up there something. It's really good for me to practice an English listening, you know. Mm, yeah, sounds very helpful indeed <laughs> and what do you think is the most difficult part then about english learning um it's quite challenging when people use different accents and some of the others words or something or vocabulary i might not notice or not know i have no idea what it is it's quite challenging you know and if people and if they video not using subtitle, it's hard for me. <laughs> that makes sense. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so you're always focused on the subtitles. Um. Yeah, it's embarrassing, but yeah. So. <laughs> I mean, it takes time to improve, right? If you can already read English subtitles and understand, that's a big step forward. <laughs> Thank you. It is. <laughs> And uh, do you watch a lot of like English movies then with subtitles or is it more like native movies? Um, most movies I watch, um, first of all, I'm just turning off the, um, the subtitle for first 10 minutes. And if it's, um, if it's going well, I just, all right, let's keep going, you know. Mm. And if, if I don't understand, I just turn it on again, you know. That makes sense, and it's a good way to challenge yourself, right? Oh, right. <laughs> yeah. So, any favorite actors or anything when you're watching movies? Um, I don't know if you know the actor or actress. I um, do you know Elizabeth Olsen? Not sure. <laughs> she plays in American uh, movies. Yeah, she's, she's playing Avengers game, Avengers or something, Marvel stuff. Okay. And the others, Blake Lively. Blake, yes. So, yeah. Oh my God, she's really hot. And the other <laughs> way, um, Ana de Armas. Sounds familiar. My... Sounds familiar you to me. You might know it. <laughs> you hmm. might know it. But that's good. So you have some people that you like to watch and it helps you improve your English. Yeah. Mm. Movies is great, actually. But sometimes I'm just press my English on people live stream. It's random, actually. And some people, most of them in USA or Brazil, Portuguese, something. Mm. And there's quite good in English. I have no idea what they're talking. I'm just trying to get the context first, you know, and it's really challenging. Yes, it's not always about understanding every word. Most of the times, if you understand the idea of what's being said, that's enough. <laughs> um, what about you? Um, since you live in Netherlands, how you speak English? How, when the first time you try, uh, try speaking English? When I was uh, younger, when I learned English, I would normally also watch movies and play games. So it was, I think, uh, the first real English conversations was when I was playing like Xbox Online, Xbox 360, oh, yeah. the original online. 
Call of Duty or Battlefield, something like that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I, I agree with that. And it was a fun way to uh, improve your English because you don't see it like learning; you just use it. Yeah, that's the important thing, I guess. Mm. I agree. Well, and do you think something... there's something else that's very important when you're learning English? <clears throat> um, I don't know, but. Um, I learned English at first time to try to hit the girl, you know, <laughs> show them the pickup lines and and see how they react. <laughs> how did that go? Did it work out well? Well, I'm just flirting. I'm not really <laughs> that that anyone. Well, it's a good <laughs> way to practice, I would say. I, uh, I guess it's um, dirty motivation, I guess. <laughs> mm. Now, whatever motivates you, right? Is, as long as your English is getting better, I think it's acceptable. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Mm. But it's nice to meet you, at least. Thank you for talking with me today. Thank you for you. Thank you for you, Lucas. Thank you for letting me join your live stream and <laughs> of course. talk with you. Hey, have a good time. See you later. Have a good time for you too. A nice guy. Hey, whatever motivates you to learn English, right? For some people, it's a job, finding friends, or dating girls. Sure. <laughs> Nothing against it. Everybody has to find their own goal and their own motivation to learn English. Don't listen too much to other people. If it works, it works.